Hi, this is Glenn White with EuroSafety. In today's tutorial, I'd like to talk about the torque calibration test that occurs on the AS350 and EC130 models of helicopters which are equipped with a VEMD. When this test occurs will be depending on what variant we're looking at. So for instance, in the B3E, when you press the warning light test, a test pattern comes up on your screens, and then when you let go of the test, you'll notice that the torque gauge goes up to 100%. And we have to look for this. We have to make sure it's 100, it's not 99, it's not 98, it's not 101, it's 100. And then it goes back down to zero. If we're looking at the EC130 T2, also equipped with the 2D engine, when we press the warning light test, it will go up to 89.5. Again, no other number, and then back down. When we're looking at the uh, AS350 2B1 and the uh, EC130 B4, this test occurs right after you engage your power. So you need to look at your VEMD, you push your power, the uh, test in progress comes up, and then you'll notice that your torque gauge goes to 70%, again, no other number, and then back down. Now, the last variant of AS350 with the VEMD is the AS350 B32B. In this helicopter, some of the software does it, some of it doesn't, depending on what variant you have. But again, it will occur right after you push the power. I hope this answers any questions you have about the torque calibration test, and we'll see you at the next Euro Safety tutorial.